Legends here. So, what's going on with this truck right okay, here? Okay, this is a 1955 Bullnose Kenworth that I haul cattle with in the early 80s. This is me. And you bought this truck brand new at the time? No, no. I bought this in a salvage yard right here is what it was. I get $300 for it oh, wait. in a salvage yard from Wichita. And we took it home. Yeah. All right, y'all. Kyla, we're good. I need hydration in my life. All right, you're good. All right. We're hanging out. How you doing, sir? Hey, I'm doing great. Good, good, good. You got some sugar and mix some other packs of sugar. Okay. Where are you on? So oh. things are closed. <laughs> yes. All you mother truckers, you're getting exclusive right now. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna give up a little bit, show a little bit, and we can do a little bit of each truck. Yes. Let's start with one. First off, uh, introduce yourself if they haven't right. seen you in a while. <laughs> yes, it's been a little bit. So I'm Kyla, and this is my family store, my grandpa Cliff, my dad Brett, and they're the ones that build all this and do everything and got us started. Oh, this is one of my favorites. This is my grandpa's bull nose Kenworth. It's a 1953, and he actually hauled cattle with it back in the 70s. And he only had it for a few years and sold it but we got it back last year. And in fact, when we bought it, my grandpa had just had surgery, went home, got out of the hospital, put his work clothes on and came straight back here. And I got to stand next to my dad and my grandpa when this truck came back in. Wow. So it was pretty cool. It was really cool. But there's some pictures here and some articles that he's been in whenever he originally had the truck and actually worked it. And he'd haul cattle from here to Florida back and forth like three times a week. That's awesome. I <laughs> yes. see the stairs. Can we see a yes, little bit inside? Yes, please, absolutely. All right, walk up and All show right. us around. So it's, there's the interior and I mean, it's nice. I don't know where all the lights are. Don't worry, <laughs> I won't edit that part. Oh gosh. That looks great. Look at that. It's Ain't cool. It's cool. And you guys have some really neat stuff here. Thanks. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Real quick, people, we're here with uh, Grandpa here, the <laughs> man that started it all. Yeah, I've heard the stories. Okay. You know, uh, Kyla talks so highly of you. Loves well, you to death. Thank you. And you know, uh, the yeah. myth and the legends here. So, what's going on with this truck right okay, here? Okay, this is a 1955 Bulldoze Kenworth that I haul cattle with in the early 80s. And uh, I haul cattle with it for about four years and uh, sold it to a man in Raton, New Mexico. And he, and I lost all track of it. After that, I didn't know where it was. All these years, I hadn't heard of it. Didn't know where it was. Last winter, his son called my son and said, my dad bought your bought the truck from your dad and he said he died in january and he said i inherited the truck i have no use for it would you be interested in buying it back brett said well what's it like after all these years he said it's exactly like it was when my dad bought it from your dad well it, that's you know maybe <laughs> maybe not but but uh, he said ask him what he wanted for it and he told him he said if you'll deliver the truck here and it's like you say it is i'll buy it and he brought it here and we couldn't believe it it had the same drive tires on it, it had on it when he that he bought it from me 35 wow. years ago oh and uh so it's come back home and it's and it this this is the paint that i put on it when i built the truck in the 1984 Two, I believe. So this is the original paint. That's, that's on. original you paint. You haven't even repainted your. Nothing. These pictures over here show me painting this truck. Let's take a look, sir. And now uh, I'm gonna go over here. Yep. This is this is me painting it back in the day, and that's the same paint that's on it right here. And this is different places. This is Bill Moon that owns Iowa 80 Iowa Truck 80, Stop. Yeah. He has passed away. Yes. 
But this was back in 84, I think, and that's me, that's Brett. We won a trophy of some type, and I'm getting an award here, and that's what that picture's about. But these are different pictures. This is Las Vegas. This truck, haul this truck, I had, this was a, a 51 Peterbilt, and uh, I'm sorry, it's a 53, and this is a 55. And I took both of these trucks to Las Vegas, right here we loaded them, and went to the King 8 truck stop in Las Vegas, King 8 truck stop and casino, they had a big truck show, and I had never been to a truck show to, of this type at all, and I took both those trucks up there. This truck won its class that it was in, this truck won the best to show. Oh, so wow. that was a pretty big feather in my cap for back in those days on the West Coast. It, kid from Oklahoma going out there, you know, that was... Now, is this you driving the truck? Yeah, that was. How old were you? <laughs> Come on, you tell us the truth. truth. <laughs> yeah, that's me. That's great, sir. This is me. This is me. And you bought this truck brand new at the time? No, no. I bought this in a salvage yard right here. What it was. I get three hundred dollars for it oh, in a salvage yard from Wichita, and we took it home and restored it. I built this truck, so that's that was the story about it. So, do you want your money back? Uh, no. <laughs> Hope you like the content, Mother Truckers. If you like what you saw, man, subscribe to the show. Hit the like button. And if you'd like to support the show and grab some merch, go to the AsianMyShow.com. I appreciate you guys. We'll see you soon.